Alrighty, welcome back to Make Geeks Let's Play Farming Simulator 2013, Episode 4. Alright, let's start it. So, last time you may have remembered that we were in the middle of harvesting a field. Um, I believe we finished. Not quite exactly sure, it's been a while. Sorry I did not put up a farming simulator or any other video yesterday. I was stuck in some bad weather. Really bad weather. So, that's why I could not post one yesterday. Alright, let's go. Alrighty, this is our farm. Kind of low on funds because we just bought a fertilizer. That's right. We bought the other field. That's what we did. Alrighty. right and I messed with the speed because I'm smart like that we got a combine that needs to finish I'll have to rearrange them though alrighty string them out and higher alrighty about this let's play I plan for this let's play to go extremely long I love this game. I want to play it until we accomplish every single thing that we want to, including beet harvesting, sugar beet harvesting, 100% cow production, milk production, I mean. <laughs> and then uh, I want to work with the biogas plant. Honestly, I'm, I'm here for the long run. I'm here to do whatever it takes to become the best farmer in Hagenstead. Hagenstead at two. Which, by the way, is not a wrestling move, so don't try it at home. Or no, you can try it at home, because it's not a wrestling move. So let's go ahead and turn this thing around. Yep. Thank you for running into me. Almost. You're welcome for almost running into you. Alright. Just unloading the combine here. Uh, we have the other field growing with canola as well, or with canola. This field right now is harvesting wheat. We are cultivating it right now with our cultivator, uh, Joseph. And then we still have Mr. No Name over there, over seeding right now. This worker is done. Ah! Darn it, wrong one. Alright, let's go ahead and dismiss this worker. You're done. Whoops, nope. Uh, pipe, that's O. Alright. Let's go put you where you need to go. All the while collecting the remains of what either Joseph or you missed. So, so far we've had three workers. We only have names for one of them, which is Joseph, who is right now plowing or cultivating my bad. Other than that, there really isn't much. Um,. Got the fertilizer last episode. This episode I plan to sell some of our harvest from our silos because waiting for a great demand I think will take too long and you know we're here to expand and become the best and the best of the best of the best of the best which is a song I'm sure. If not it should be. So that's our plans. Um, things are kind of slow in the beginning, not doing much. Besides rinsing and repeating, you know, you do it over and over and over again. So I think I'm going to go ahead and sell some of our crops to get a bigger trailer so then we can sell the other crops quicker. Yeah, I get that. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah. Um. Might go around and explore the map a little. Looking for horseshoes. Uh, I don't think there's any around here. If there is, let me know in the comments. Just gonna park this baby. The baby of the time. Ooh. Ooh. Alright, man, 
a bigger trailer, but over a bigger cedar. Holy cow, tough decisions. Because that dude is just taking forever. Um. Hmm. I think I'm going to call the guy on the cedar right now, Jarrell. I think Jarrell is a nice name to have for a worker. Alright, so we got Jarrell and Joseph, JJ, working so far on our fields. Let's take a look at how much we have of each uh, grain in our silos. That was canola. What? I'm so confused. Oh well, alright. So we have more canola. We have quite a bit of wheat. I think I'm gonna go ahead and sell the wheat. Wheat is selling the most at the mill for 133. Yep, mill. Although it's going up. So by the time we get there, it'll be worth more. Alright, sounds great. Sounds absolutely, positively super delicious. Alright, which one is wheat? So we got maize or corn, canola, wheat. Wheat must be the last one, because I know barley has those prickly thingies coming out of it. I suppose wheat kind of does that too a little. I don't know, but this should be wheat. Make sure. Yup, this is wheat. Alright, now we know for next time. I know for next time. That's where we pick up seeds, by the way, over there in that corner. If we want to put seeds in our sower. But with a worker, he so he supplies his own seeds and his own uh no he doesn't provide his own fuel, he uses our fuel. Pretty sure. Don't quote me though. So we're just going to the mill, which you should probably figure out where that is. Get this. The mill? The other direction. Where is this? Is it? No. I'm heading the right way. What am I doing? Yeah, the mill's up here. I don't know what I'm thinking. Alright. Let's take a look at the weather report. Brought to you by Giants. Today, Wednesday, and Thursday, and Friday are all sunny. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, sunny, except for Tuesday. Actually, partly cloudy. Holy cow. Whoosh. Can you believe it? There's actually some temperature change. Other than that partly cloudy, it's pretty sunny the whole whole next two weeks. Now the mill should be straight down here. Yep, there it is. I still have to get used to this map myself, so. And just turn over here. Holy cow, you can take money out right here. Wow. I can do that desperate. I wonder how it knows which side to jump on. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Alright. So we made a good $6,000 off of that 1,500 units a week. Not bad at all. Ah, oh, we went down now. Alright, we got here. Alright, let's see. Open up. Con Canola went up, holy cow. It is worth 2400 at the end. My goodness gracious. To the silos to pick up canola so we can go to the inn. On our way there, let's check out the store, see how much another trailer costs. Costs. Sorry. Tippers, tippers, that's what we like to call them. 21,000. We got 7,000. Now you see what I could do is take out a loan. 
You know, as good as that sounds, I, living in America, I kind of know how debt works and how you accumulate it, accumulate it, and that right there is how you do it. One of the ways that you can do it. So I'm not too fond about doing that, but... I mean, if you guys want me to, I will. And I mean, if it if it seems like the better decision, then by golly, why not? Right, so let's go ahead and head down to our silos. Our house is so pretty. I'm not quite sure what this other house is, if that's our neighbor or what exactly that is. Oh, later on in the game, you will see, like, gardens or... Yeah, we indoor gardens. I don't, I don't know what you call them. Where you, like, they require water. Fountain at fountains like these, you can refill your water tanks. So you can bring them to the um, greenhouses. That's what you call them. Everyone calls them. Alrighty. Canola, that's the first one. Darn it, second one. Close enough. Alrighty, 5,700, sorry, not 1,500. What am I thinking? I'm sure you guys, just that past, like, however long ago that was, like, six minutes, you guys were probably, like, screaming at me, No! It's 5,700! Not 1,500! And the end's the other way. Probably screaming at me right now, too. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's still early in the game, so... We're off to the inn, which is this way through town. And then after we sell that, we can probably pick up whatever it is that we want to buy on the way back. Whoa, 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 open Gundam style. I do not own that song, or the name, or the trademark. Not mine. However, it is a pretty good song. Got a ton of hits on YouTube. Alrighty. Oh, I, I, yeah. Post in the comments what you think of this Let's Play. Um, let me know if you guys want me to, what you guys want me to uh, try to achieve, achieve first. I think we should have pretty set goals on what we want to achieve. So, you know, then with the money that we earn, it's not confusing on what exactly we should buy. And So leave that in the comments. Um, oh, I got a special thanks coming up. I will mention these special thanks at the end of the video, so make sure you watch to the end. This YouTuber helped me download and install mods for Farming Simulator 2013 on the Mac. So he deserves a special thanks and a round of applause. And it will be more formal at the end of the video, so make sure you stick in. Alrighty, sweet twenty-one thousand dollars. My goodness gracious! Oh man, I don't even know why I do that. I'm just excited. If you hear those jingles in the background, that's my dog. But right, anyways, you know it's Christmas time. They're in the Christmas spirit with the jingle bells. Twenty-one thousand. How much should I say that turn of cost? P twenty-one thousand. Holy guac. I think we still should get a little bit more money first. I know where we can get that money. We can sell the current trailer that we have to get the bigger one. Boom! Upgrade! However, the cedar. Oh, the cedar. Oh, man. How much I want any one of those. I mean, we'll have a big enough trailer to transport the crops and sell them, but the cedar won't be able to produce at the same level that we're selling. Mm. I'll stop at the store here real quick and see how much a cedar costs, or what cedar costs what. See if we get a new cedar or a new tractor, maybe I don't know. The tractor's cheap and.
price is good, aka cheap, and you know there might be a deal. I don't know yet. I really do like the scenery though. I mean this um Oh, hey, I missed the sign that said this was one way, Lane Hogger. Sorry, excuse me, pardon me. I really like the, uh, Scot Scot Scottish kind of feel to it. No, don't hit me. Alright. So, we'll go ahead and enter the store because we're here. Tractor Green for go. I will also show you the mods that I installed thanks to the special YouTuber of the episode. Or just of the week or this Let's Play. Alrighty, so the mods that I got. Animals, placeable objects, mods. I got the Lizard ATV and the Lamborghini R6125. Um, what else did I... Those were just the mods that I got. Anyways... Let's look at sowers, cedars, sewing machines. So we got 2.1, 26,000 for a 3 meter. Oh, I kind of want to save up for that. But then again, it, it sows wheat, barley, canola, or grass. The Horsch Express is a compact seed drill with direct seeding functionality. This seeder directly cultivates the ground before seeding, which increases the efficiency a lot. So if I sold my cultivator, tell you what, this is what I'm going to do. I feel as though this is the time to go ahead and take out a larger, more substantial loan to increase the efficiency and pay it back. So let's borrow that much. Alrighty. R. So let's go ahead and get this guy. I mean, this guy I would get, but he only plants potatoes. I don't. I can't harvest those right now. Thirty-five thousand. Still only three meters. But what is better about this one? Amazon's AD slash P three hundred three super mounted drill combination is particularly suitable for small to medium sized farms. Looking for compact and universally deployable drilling systems. Thirty dollars a day, two thousand. Thirty oh, fifteen hundred. Yeah, I, I think this one is still our best bet. All right. Wait, let's see how much I can sell this trailer for. Wait, let me just. What I what do I own? The trailer, please. Scroll up. All right, so forty nine hundred versus. I would back this up, but I cannot with this wheel in the front. I have to get out of here. Wait, what if the trailer? No, no way, Jose! I want to keep my tractor. All right, let's back out of here and do this again. Oh, oh, oh! No, 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 no! Sorry, can't. This is kind of a small square for such a weird trailer to maneuver. There we go. So let's sell R and get 29. What did it say before? P. Oh, I bet you that was to buy it. Uh huh. All right. 2450 or. 2940. Yeah, it's still better. Now we only have 8,000. For... Alright, bigger loan. We need 21. That'll do. So we have a $75,000 loan that we need to pay off. But now we have a new cedar and new trailer. Wait. It's a new trailer. Tippers. This Gilbert. Bye. There we go. Alright, I think I will go ahead and end the episode here. We got our new cedar, our new trailer, or tipper. Uh, we plan to increase our efficiency by tenfold, hopefully, with these with this new equipment. 
So tune in to next episode to see what exactly or how exactly this new equipment will work with our previous machinery and how much our efficiency will go up and what exactly we're going to be planting, harvesting, selling, or whatever we're doing next episode. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time to McGeek. Let's play Farming Simulator 2013, Episode 4. I would like to thank Gummick or Gummike for helping me install mods on Farming Simulator 2013 onto my Mac. Thanks. Without you, I wouldn't be able to install mods and make this Let's Play successful. Thanks.